Dr. Shahar's team have been working to discover the true extent of Hib across the country. The situation with Hib in Bangladesh is really very grave because 50% of the all meningitis cases who are coming to this hospital are due to the Hib. And second, we found that 30% of the severe pneumonia cases are due to Hib. The Dakar Shishu is one of the very few hospitals in Bangladesh with a laboratory actively investigating and looking for the life-threatening Hib bacteria. Most of the time, this killer goes undetected. Identification of Hib or detection of Hib is difficult because it is a fragile organism and it needs resources to culture this organism. Most of the labs in the country are not having the resources to culture this organism. And that's the reason the overall heap burden in the country remaining underestimated. Little Lima has been put on antibiotics, but her lab result reveals something else. So after isolation of heap from Lima's case, we tested it like a quick test, which indicates that it is resistant to first line of antibiotic. So we have to go for second line, more powerful and expensive antibiotic to treat this hip meningitis case. And it's not just Lima. Similar results are being found right across Bangladesh. So in the recent years, we are encountering more and more uh, drug resistant strains and they're mainly resistant to the antibiotic which are readily available in the hospital and which is cheaper. And so pediatricians are facing the challenge to treat these cases because they need to use the most expensive drugs which are not readily available in the hospital. And that's why treatment is delayed. And this delay in treatment in leading to the more disability and more death.